Welcome to Diamond World Tours. Ever wondered what you could do in Tokyo in just 48 hours? A city that never hits the snooze button? Tokyo is the perfect destination. This metropolis is a seamless blend of the past and the future, where ancient temples rub shoulders with cutting-edge architecture, and where tranquil gardens are just a stone's throw away from neon-lit streets. As the sun sets, Tokyo's districts transform into a luminous spectacle of neon lights, painting the cityscape in hues of technicolor dreams. The air buzzes with energy as izakayas, or Japanese pubs, come alive with locals and tourists alike, savoring the city's vibrant nightlife. Night markets burst at the seams with mouth-watering street food, unique trinkets and the infectious hum of every corner of Tokyo is a new surprise waiting to be discovered, each street a narrative of tradition and innovation. So, buckle up as we embark on a whirlwind tour of Tokyo, this city is just waiting to be explored. First stop, Shibuya Crossing, the world's busiest pedestrian crossing. There's a certain thrill, an electric energy that one feels when standing at the heart of this human tide. It's a dance that happens every few minutes, where hundreds of people stride forth from all directions, crossing paths in an organized chaos. Shibuya Crossing is more than just a pedestrian crosswalk. It's a testament to the rhythm of Tokyo life, a heartbeat in the city's ever-pulsating tempo. The air is thick with the buzz of conversations, the hum of traffic, and the glow of neon signs from the surrounding skyscrapers. It's the symphony of city life at its most vibrant. And as you navigate through the sea of people, you'll find yourself amidst a shopper's paradise. From high-end fashion boutiques to quirky local stores, Shibuya's shopping scene is as diverse as the people crossing its streets. It's a place where tradition meets modernity, and local businesses compete with international brands for the attention of the discerning shopper. Just a stone's throw from the crossing stands the iconic Hachiko statue. A symbol of loyalty and devotion, Hachiko's story is one that resonates with locals and tourists alike. It's a quiet spot of reflection amidst the bustling cityscape. From Shibuya, we move to a place of tranquility amidst the city's hustle and bustle. Welcome to the Imperial Palace, a stark contrast to the busy streets of Shibuya. This serene oasis, nestled in the heart of Tokyo, provides a tranquil retreat from the city's fast-paced rhythm. The Imperial Palace wasn't always here, though. Its history goes back to the 15th century, when it was known as Edo Castle, the seat of the Tokugawa shogunate. It's said that Ieyasu Tokugawa, the first shogun of the Edo period, chose this spot for its strategic location, surrounded by rivers and moats. In the late 19th century, when the emperor moved his residence from Kyoto, Edo Castle was transformed into the Imperial Palace. But don't let the name fool you, the palace isn't just a single building, it's an expansive complex with multiple structures including the main palace, the private residences of the imperial family, and an archive, museum, and administrative offices. However, the crown jewel of the imperial palace has to be the East Gardens. A stroll through these beautifully manicured gardens is like stepping back in time. The East Gardens stand on the former grounds of Edo Castle's innermost circles of defense, the Hanmaru and Ninomaru. Here you'll see remnants of the old castle tower and fortifications, interspersed with tranquil ponds, sweeping lawns, and bursts of seasonal flowers. It's a sight to behold, especially in spring, when cherry blossoms blanket the gardens in a soft pink hue. But perhaps what makes the Imperial Palace so special is its stark contrast to the bustling city life. Despite being in the heart of Tokyo, the palace grounds offer a remarkable sense of calm and tranquility. It's as if the city's noise and chaos are held at bay by the palace's ancient moats and stone walls. From one historical site to another, next, we visit the oldest temple in Tokyo. Next stop, Sensoji Temple, a place where history and culture come alive. Nestled in the district of Asakusa, the Sensoji Temple is a beacon of tradition in a city renowned for its cutting-edge modernity. This temple, a spectacle of grandeur, stands as Tokyo's oldest and most significant Buddhist temple. It's like stepping back in time with the temple's history dating back to the 7th century. Legend has it that two brothers fished a golden statue of Canon, the goddess of mercy, out of the Sumida River, and even though they put the statue back into the river, it kept returning to them. To honor Canon, the Sensoji Temple was built for her worship and has been a site of pilgrimage ever since. The Sensoji Temple is more than just a historical monument, it's a living, breathing part of Tokyo's culture. It's a place where locals and visitors alike come to find serenity amidst the city's hustle and bustle. 
From the early morning rituals of devout Buddhists to the throngs of tourists making their wishes at the main hall, the temple is a testament to Tokyo's harmonious blend of the old and the new. As we make our way to the temple, we can't overlook the bustling Nakami shopping street. This vibrant shopping street, stretching over 200 meters, leads directly to the temple's imposing Thunder Gate. Here, tradition meets commerce with a variety of shops selling everything from traditional Japanese snacks and sweets to handmade souvenirs and crafts. It's a feast for the senses, with the tantalizing aroma of fresh senbei rice crackers wafting through the air and the sight of colorful yukata fabrics catching your eye at every turn. In the heart of a city that never sleeps, the Sensoji Temple offers a serene retreat, a tangible connection to the city's past, and a vibrant cultural hub. It's a place where history is not just remembered but lived and breathed every day. As day turns to night, Tokyo transforms, revealing a whole new side to explore. As the sun sets, Tokyo lights up, revealing a city that truly never sleeps. As day gives way to night, the city undergoes a transformation, shedding its daytime persona and embracing the dazzling allure of the night. Welcome to Tokyo After Dark, a world where the vibrant nightlife illuminates the city. From the lively chatter of izakaya traditional Japanese pubs to the bustling night markets offering an array of tantalizing street food, Tokyo's nightlife is as dynamic as the city itself. Each corner turned, each street crossed brings a new experience, a new story to tell. Now, let's wander through the neon-lit streets of Roppongi, a district known for its bustling nightlife and international vibe. Here, you'll find a blend of traditional and modern, with high-end clubs and bars sitting comfortably next to quiet, tucked-away izakaya. This is a place where you can rub shoulders with Tokyo's elite, and perhaps even catch a glimpse of a celebrity or two. But the night is young, and there's still much to see. Let's head over to Shinjuku, Tokyo's entertainment powerhouse. This district is a sensory overload with its bright lights, towering skyscrapers, and the constant hum of activity. It's home to Kabukicho, Tokyo's red light district, and Golden Guy, a network of narrow alleys lined with tiny bars, each with its own unique personality. Here in Shinjuku, you can indulge in everything from karaoke to live music, enjoy a drink at a quiet bar, or dance the night away at a club. And if you're a fan of the unusual, you might want to check out the robot restaurant, where you can enjoy a dinner show like no other. Tokyo's nightlife is a testament to its character, vibrant, diverse, and ever-changing. It's a city that embraces the new while respecting the old, a city that knows how to have fun when the sun goes down. Tokyo After Dark is a sight to behold, a perfect end to our whirlwind tour. And just like that, 48 hours in Tokyo fly by. In the blink of an eye, We've traversed the bustling streets of Shibuya, where the city's pulse is as vibrant as the neon lights that illuminate it. We've experienced the world's busiest pedestrian crossing, a testament to Tokyo's ceaseless rhythm and remarkable harmony amidst chaos. We've roamed the serene grounds of the Imperial Palace, a sanctuary amidst the city's skyscrapers. This splendid oasis, with its lush gardens and tranquil moats, stands as a testament to Japan's rich history and enduring traditions. We've stepped back in time at the Sensoji Temple, Tokyo's oldest and most significant Buddhist temple. This spiritual haven with its towering pagoda and bustling market stalls offers a glimpse into the city's soul, where old and new seamlessly blend. Tokyo after dark? A whole different world. The city transforms into a kaleidoscope of color and sound, with districts like Shinjuku and Roppongi coming alive with bustling izakayas, captivating street performances, and mesmerizing light displays. In essence, Tokyo is a city of contrasts. A city where tradition coexists with modernity, where serene temples stand amidst towering skyscrapers, and where the pace of life changes as the sun sets, revealing a vibrant and diverse nightlife. This whirlwind tour has only scratched the surface of what Tokyo has to offer, a city that surprises and delights at every turn, a city that deserves more than just 48 hours. So when are you booking your ticket to Tokyo? Don't forget to subscribe for more interesting facts.